here you have uh, this is a nine plate B cell setup I read that it's some super efficient design so I, I made it and to see how it works and it, it sucks big time it's nothing like what it stated I'm going to turn it on for you guys so you can see how much it sucks This thing is only pulling like f 6 amps right now. 7 volts. And this thing is just... The production is extremely low. B cell setup blows. Six amps. That's it. Horrible. I'll let her on for like a couple of hours. See if anything happens. B cell setup design. Look at it. The water temperature 74 degrees. Seventy, you can see seventy four, seventy five. Seventy four degrees. Look at it. It's only pulling seven amps. This cold start we've been running for five minutes. Seventy-three degrees. Hmm, Seventy-eight degrees. Seventy-six. Seventy-seven. Okay, what I have here is a regular. Um, 19 plate setup with 5 neutrals in between 2 positives, 2 negatives and 5 neutrals in between and here you got that B cell setup I'm just going to compare these two see how, uh, how they run ok Start the unit up, see. Mm -hmm. and this thing is producing, f this is 15 amps, it's pulling both of them.
They are both. They're both pulling about 12. 12, 13 amps. And just the B cell was put in six, pulling 6 amps. Two positives, two negatives. And then I added a regular design. Two positives, two negatives. 12 amps. 13 amps. So it just doubles. Almost the same amount of amps. temperature 76 degrees here 77, 78 degrees here 80 degrees 74 degrees This is a B cell design with a regular design I see no no difference whatsoever well this one seems to produce more HHO than the B cell maybe you can see it on the top of the gas is just boiling up compared over there it's just slowly This thing's been running for like an hour. Same old 14 amp. I think it went up to like 14 amps or something. Let's look. Yeah, 14 amps. 